Hey guys, if you want to dominate in Madden 18, head on over to Madden247.com where you can pick up the full access guide to Madden 18 and any ebooks. This is the best content that you're going to find anywhere and it's more than half off other websites. And if you want to support me directly, head on over to Patreon.com where not only are you going to be getting the best content, but you're also going to be entered into giveaways. So if you're interested, head on over to the links in the description below. What's up guys, in this video we're going to go over how to fix the base align press issue to where they do not misalign. And there's two different ways we can do this. You see if we just do base align press, what happens is the cornerback plays inside position on the wide side of the field. And what people are doing is they're like max protecting and they're just lobbing up a streak to their fastest receiver. And you see the great separation they get. He's at least beating about five yards. So the way we fix this is we could either base align and press twice. And what that's going to do is get the cornerback over the receiver. So you see if we base align once, press, base align twice, and then see how he moves over the receiver. Now we're doing a six speed difference. Uh, so the receiver is six points better. But you see if we had a cornerback that is closer uh, in ratings with speed, especially if you do coaching adjustments and set your best cornerback on your best uh, uh, receiver speed-wise, they will. if you have a 95-speed corner and they have a 96-speed uh, receiver, it's going to be evenly matched and you can click on and swat the ball. But here, there's a big difference. Um, the cornerback has 90-speed and the receiver has 96. So this is not recommended if you have slower corners but this does fix the base align press issue uh, of misaligning the other way to do it is to base align and then man align and then press uh, that is another way to do it but uh, you can do, like I said you can do the base align press twice or base align man align press so hope you all enjoyed this video on how to fix a issue in the game I thought it was gonna be fixed uh, with the new patch but it was not so this is the way to uh, fix it yourself in game and uh, not have to worry about giving up a one play touchdown so hope you all enjoyed the video uh, be sure to check out madden247.com and subscribe to the youtube channel and check out patreon.com if you want to support me directly